Hi, this is Brian with 7 All Makes Everyday Engineering. Well, welcome back and thanks for watching. Today we'd like to share some ideas for printing Christmas gifts and various things. Uh, if you have a 3D printer, you might want to put it to use now and print some of the things that you've always wanted to print and create some unique things. This is a Christmas ornament that I printed. It's a very unique, uh, very intricate design. You can see it has a lot of intricate uh, shapes to it. Uh, it also has uh, just a curvature at the top, which gives it kind of that curved, uh, carved from wood kind of look to it. Very detailed. Uh, take a look at printing it in different color filaments as well. Uh, I printed it in a gold filament, and you'll see that, but maybe a silver or a white. Uh, you can try out different uh, colors of filament with this. Well, having a 3D printer means that you can print out various game pieces. And this is the pawn uh, that is uh, made by Chep, and it's available, and we'll put a link to it uh, down below. Uh, you can see, just as I put it into the Kira Slicer program, I'm taking a look at it here. And that's one thing to always do, is just to, uh, before you go ahead and print it, see what size it is. Is it the size you want? you can size it up or down, as well as um, right now I'm taking a look and realizing that it's at a pretty large uh, layer height and the infill is set pretty low. Uh, originally was set at 20% and especially just to uh, have a nice look to it, would want a finer layer height to it and to add some infill to it just so that at those smaller points in the part it doesn't become weak and break. I did have that happen actually uh, when I printed it first time so I added in uh, some more infill and uh, made the steps smaller so it came out uh, finer and gave a nice look to it. So just always take a look uh, for different designs that you can make of game pieces. But before you print it, take a look at different settings and try some different settings and see how it works. Well, here's the pawns that I printed in different colors and it gave me a good reason to buy different colors. Oh, and here's the rook as well. Uh, two rooks have come in and are trying to uh, Oh, well, oh no, they're outnumbered and the pawns are pushing them off the edge. Oh, ah, it looks like just like lemmings, they're all falling off the other side with them. Oh, the silver one, he's superior. Oh, he trips on that clip and the white one comes back on. Okay, here's Benchy. You can print Benchy in different sizes, different colors as well. Well, in a different video, we featured the design and build of the Rainbow Stacker. And in this one, well, we just mostly wanted to use the stop motion feature uh, to show stacking them and playing with them and what it would look like. Uh, yeah, it just kind of gave us a, an excuse to have some fun with it. Enjoy. Well, a popular online game right now is called Among Us, and there's several different Among Us characters that are available on Thingiverse. So take a look. Uh, we put the link in the, the description below for these three characters that I printed out in three different colors. One of my daughters has Barbie dolls, and she was asking, is it possible to print a laptop notebook for her Barbie dolls? So I found this on Thingiverse, and I sized it down to 33%.
So that's one thing you want to check is what size is it and what size do you want it to be? It does come in two pieces and prints flat as I'm showing here in the design program. I had a little bit of hard time to get them to snap together after printing, but after a little bit of uh, carving away on the pieces, it did fit together, thankfully. Uh, but just check out the size and um, make sure that you're printing it at the size you want. And here's what it looked like when it printed out and when they were uh, snapped together. I was happy with the detail uh, that it had and printed it in black. And the Barbies were really happy to be able to uh, video call their friends and then uh, also watch their big screen TV that I 3D printed with the miniature rainbow. Well, if you enjoyed this video, please hit the like button and also subscribe so you'll see future videos. Thanks a lot. Have a great day.